Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, whatever time you guys listening or watching this, man. It's Marky, aka Severe, aka Severe yours. Like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and comment below, man. We're going to Buffalo, Boston, the Buffalo, to go visit Pretty Bully, man. Pretty Bully, man. She is a phenomenal MC, rapper, uh, artist that I recently discovered, and um, I'm a fan, man. Um, she came out with the album recently. Um, today actually it's called Thin and Now and it's fully produced by Kid Called Quest. I like that name, Kid Tribe Called Quest, Kid Called Quest. Brilliant name as a producer. Um, Thin and Now. I like the the title. Uh, the music seems like it's more of the thin and the the rapping's more of the now. You guys let me know what you guys think of the album. What are your favorite tracks? Uh, what do you think of uh, Pretty Bully and Kid Called Quest? If you guys are fans of these two, let me know uh, their best projects in the comments below. Right, let's get to know these artists together. Um, this came out March 29th, 2024. 35 minutes, 17 seconds. First track is the intro. It's basically Bully explains, you know, the beginning, the beginning of her pen game. Like, you know, the, you know, people are asking her questions. You know, she's using a lot of footage from actual um, interviews of or, or podcast that she's recently been on for this album. So that's dope. I like that. Um, maybe she'll use some of mine one day. Wink, wink, wink. No, I'm just kidding. Anyway, so this is like the intro, and Bully's just explaining, you know, how she developed her pen game, how she is who she is now, and why she is who she is now, and things of that nature, man. So I like it, man. She explains why she's dope with the pen, man. Y'all, If y'all listening to her, y'all fans, y'all know why. Uh, number two, she's a problem. Yes, she is a problem. Yes, she's a problem. First song bangs like chicken heads on OnlyFans. Listen, when Pretty Bully raps, she's entertaining, she's sharp, and she's clever with her pen schemes. Dope record. I know it's too short. It comes out like, listen, the intro talks about what's going on, then she does the song. That keeps us interested. Like, this is the song that's like, yo, look, I can rap. I'm dope. I got bars. And you're like, oh, shoot. That's, so that's number two. So it's short, but it's like, gets your attention, right? Now number three, confidence. Boom. You know what I'm saying? Hits us. Just with the confidence. We have another rewindable rapper, man, guys. We have another rewindable rapper. And I love the confidence that she portrays uh, on the mic and, and, of course, in life. Uh, let's speak on Pretty Bully's pen game. Pen game is superb. Uh, I'm a fan of how she breathes pure hip hop. Uh, production keeps the head nodding as her bars become rewindable. Like when I get introduced to a new rapper and I enter their world with their albums and EPs and such, and uh, I just get in enthused and intrigued. And when they can get me to rewind their bars, Pretty Bully, you got me, man. You got me. Number four, remember. Uh, song makes you remember your childhood. This is These are songs. Uh, she's an artist. She's got to make you feel. She's making me feel things. She's making me remember on this album, on this record. Uh, remember gets, um, rapper gets, uh, you know, in her story mode, you know, bag, bringing us back in her days. Uh, the beat brings joy uh, to the table as she reminisces Reminisce, reminisce, reminiscing. Shout out to maybe Jay. Um, but uh, let's go to number five. Simplicity. Get ready to rewind and say, um, oh, snap a lot. Or whatever you say, Dan. Or yo, rewind that. Whatever you're saying is, you're going to be doing that when you listen to Pretty Bully. Um, quotable bars, rewindable bars, um, entertaining bars. You're like, oh, snap. And you're like, yo, she, what'd she say? <laughs> like that, that type of stuff. So, uh, on Simplicity, Kid Call Quest is deep down south with this soulful beat. Uh, pretty Bars, a.k.a. Bully Business, a.k.a. Pretty Bully. Got lyrics for days. This joint's fire. Joint's fire. Number six, Homage. Kid Call Quest is paying homage to MC Light. Shout out to MC Light, one of my favorites. Um... Go check out her new single. She got albums. I think she got an album coming out. Like, but um, let's get back to the scene. 
So I'm going to MC Light, man. I'm getting all excited. But anyway, the bit sex homage. Um, Kick Off Quest is paying homage to MC Light on this track as Pretty Bully pays homage to the other female legends such as uh, Light and others, um, Latifah and everybody else, and other greats uh, prior to her. She just given homage and, and love to people that she respected and that came before her. And the reason that she has a career based on them, and that's why she's giving homage and, and love to them. Pretty Bully... Um, it's extra points for you know, just paying homage. You get extra points to your artist and you pay homage to the past. You just do, you know. Number seven is called Basic B A S I C. Um, you know, it makes you think of basic instruction. We leave you leaving earth. You know, shout out to uh but you know, uh number seven basic, this stands for uh broads always secretly in competition. <laughs> Yo, crazy. I like the acronym. Um, I like the lane Pretty Bully is taken against these salty female rappers. And she may be speaking of women in general in her life, in her circle. You know, you know they say women are, are broads always secretly in competition. They say women are always in competition. I don't know. Y'all let me know. I don't want no, no beat. But um, beat is relaxing. And, and as Bully, you know, checks these basics. She che she's checking these basic, these these. Basic whatever, right? Just checking these basics. Um, I like the record. I like number seven. I like basic. So shout out to basic. Number eight, Safe Bet featuring uh, Curtis Coke. I believe he's the rapper. And the singer is the Source Academy kid. Uh, pretty Safe Bet uh, is on Bully. My bet's on Bully. Uh, her skills continue to impress me. Features give the song additional sauce. The singer, uh, the singer's a bit off, man. But maybe that's maybe that's intentional. I'm not sure. Uh, but the rapper stamped the package. Shout out to the feature. I think it's Curtis Coke that rapped, I believe. Uh, number nine, Don't Judge Me. I like this record. Slick Bully. She got different. I'm giving her different nicknames, man. Slick Bully getting her bedtime story on. This is a, this is not a children's story uh, like Ricky's. But it's a story adults unfortunately experience you know it's, it's one of those those roomy stories man but you gotta hear it man it happens this is stories is life man um uh, but don't judge me man i like i like the record so uh if it's if it's actually her story that's that's uh, uh um brave for her to share it in that form so uh number 10 relate featuring curtis coke ken c and jazzo shout out to jazzo uh beat rings like it's an old school jazzy tune. Uh, features bring additional heat to the record. Uh, I relate to the posse cut. This is a posse cut, so y'all can put this up for posse cut of the year. I relate to the posse cut song uh, like this. The the artist keep it simple. It's beats and bars. Let me say to keep it simple. Beats and bars. That's all you need. You got a dope beat track. All you need is the bars, man, and they're providing them. And shout out to living legend Jazzo. Jazzo, what up, man? Um, yeah, man. Jazzo still got bars, man. Shout out to Jazzo. Uh, number 11, thank you. Uh, Pretty Bully is vulnerable over this 90s style Mary J. Blige cut. Um, we get to know more about the queen, uh, Pretty Bully. She's really good with her pen, you know, with the stories and just the way she uh, fragments. Um, her bars and her lyrics and stuff like that. So, um, shout out to uh, 716. 716 in the building, man. Buffalo's in the building, man. And she's representing well. So, shout out. I know Buffalo is proud of uh, Pretty Bully. Uh, number 12, break. Um, what's your breaking point? Everyone has a breaking point. You know, I'm not going to get into it. I just, just want to say the question. If you want to answer it, you answer it. Um, break number 12, we get the thin. Production from Kid Called Quest, and we get the now from uh, you know, the rapper, you know, Pretty Bully. Uh, back, uh, uh, it just seems like you know, the producer using a lot of back in the day, so that's why I'm thinking thin and now. I keep going back to the thin and now, the title, so I'm, that's what I keep. So, anyway, number 12 break. Let me finish the uh, 
review, but don't break this duo up. I think uh, this producer and this rapper got a good vibe, a good chemistry. This album is great. It is pretty good. Great writer, you know, and we got a great producer. So, I mean, that usually equals to a great combination of good music. Um, like, subscribe, and the notification bell, man. Comment below what y'all think about this album, what y'all think about these artists. Uh, get the books if you can. What I got? This is number two. Surveys Chronicles, Surveys Classics, Volume 2. Uh, volume 1 is out there, too. You know what I'm saying? I know Pretty Bully, you gotta make one of these books. You probably make Volume 3, Volume 4 or something. But I got six books out there. Y'all support if you want. Get the merch if you can. Get the hoodie. Every city can rep this. Every city. Come on, man. Everybody in the world can rock this. You know what I'm saying? So get the hoodie. Support if you can. Or any merch. You know what I'm saying? Support. One love, though, man. Let's get to the last track. Uh, Sway Freestyle. Ooh. The Sway. Listen, you made it when you... Listen, when you want Sway, you made it. Bully, you made it. You made it, right? She got the Sway stamp. So, number 13, Sway Freestyle. Uh, pretty bully on sway. What else can you say? Uh, she, you know, she made, uh, she made it in my eyes when you're on sway. Uh, this beat is fire too. This beat is dope. Love this beat. This beat is crazy. This beat's fire. Uh, but these bars are more. These beats are more fire. I mean, the the bars are more fire actually. The, the beats fire. Then the bars are more fire. The bars are tougher than the than than buckwheat's buckshots. The bars are tougher than buckwheat's buckshots. You know what I'm saying? Let me stop. But um, if y'all get it, 2024, I think it's pretty bully. I'm not sure who uh, is, uh, who has the production, who has the rights. Uh, I couldn't find that information. But if y'all do know, let me know. Uh, what y'all think about this album? 13 tracks of pure heat, man. It just came out. Uh, pretty bully from Buffalo. You coming back from Buffalo. I'm not sure where Kid Call Quest is from. If y'all know where Kid Call Quest is from, let me know. Let the world know. Uh, this album, Thin and Now, I like it. This is the first album that got my attention on this week. That's all I'm going to say. There's a lot of albums that came out this week. Um, there's other albums that I'm going to be reviewing, but this is the first album that said, yo, that got me to go, yo, I need to start writing again. And Pretty Bully, you got me to write. Uh, Cape Call Quest, you got me to write. So Thin and Now. Um, all right, y'all, I'm getting out of here, man. Pretty Bully, Kid Call Quest. Thanks for the music. Remember, love over hate, man. All right, yo, I'm getting out of here. Buffalo soldier, buffalo soldier. The ball steam.